Continuing our coverage now, 72 hours after a federal judge's ruling, four Indiana counties are still not issuing same-sex marriage licenses. That includes Davies County in southwestern Indiana. Clerk Sherry Healy says her religious beliefs tell her that marriage should be only between a man and a woman. But as Derek Thomas reports, her brother disagrees. The joy of same-sex matrimony flourished in many counties, including here in Marion. But in Davies County, Clerk Sherry Healy refuses to issue same-sex marriage licenses. I feel like our country was founded on the biblical principle that marriage is between one man and one woman, and that I felt like I was going to stand on that principle until I get an order to do otherwise. Healy has a Marion County connection. Her brother lives here in Indianapolis. And guess what? He's gay. 49-year-old Kevin Fife lives with his partner, 51-year-old Doug Lida, on the north side. Fife believes his sister is on the wrong side of this issue. Well, I understand her religious convictions. We're from a very religious family, a very faith-based family. I'm really probably more disappointed that as an elected official, as a civil servant, um, she's not obeying the judge's order and obeying the law of the land. You know, even the attorney general of the state of Indiana, who's vehemently anti-same-sex marriage, you know, asked for the county clerks to respect the judgment. This is a photograph of Healy holding her younger brother when they were children. Fife says he isn't trying to demonize his sister. He says she is kind and charitable, but she is blocking progress. Law professor David Ortenlicker says Davies County's same-sex couples could file a class action lawsuit against Healy. It may be that just threatening to go to court would be enough. Um, there's, gonna, there's obviously a lot of political pressure on her right now, and, and hopefully that will be sufficient to change her mind. That might change her mind, but it certainly has changed this family dynamic. Derek Thomas, RTV6. Davis County Attorney Grant Schwartzentruber told RTV6 that the clerk is waiting to see if the federal judge issues a stay. If he does not, however, he says that she will follow the law.